hey everyone welcome back so this is the another scenario based power bi interview questions which has been asked by the interviewer of the deloitte during the recruitment process of power bi developer okay so the question is that there are two slices and five visuals in a particular page of the power bi report okay and when i am clicking on the first slicer other visuals are getting filtered okay but when i am clicking on the second slicer the other visuals are not filtering can you tell me what are the most important five reasons that might be due to which the second slicer is not affecting to the other five visuals this is the question okay so let's see what are the top five reasons that may be due to which the second slicer is not affecting to other five visuals so if we will go for the answer part then it might be there are so many different reasons are there due to which the second slicer is not affecting to the other visual of that particular page okay but if we will consider only the top five one then in the first point we can consider this is happening due to the relationship in the data model it means there must be a valid relationship between the field that is used in the second slicer and the field in the visual you expect to be filtered okay and remember one thing in power bi relationship between the tables play a crucial role in filtering data okay in the power bi report so it might be the first reason due to which the second slicer is not working properly okay then considering into the second point it might be due to the inappropriate configurations of the slicer okay it means you have to make sure that the configurations of the second slicer must be set up correctly and you have to ensure that the slicer is bound to the appropriate field all right if it will not appropriate to the proper field then the slicer will definitely not work okay this is the second reason due to which that might be the second slicer is not working then moving into the third point it might be due to the cross filter directions it means depending on the nature of your data you may need to set the cross filter directions to both or single to control how the filtering across between the tables okay if you will not set the directions correctly then the data will not flow properly okay that's why you have to make sure that the directions has been given appropriately okay so this might be the third case due to which the filter is not working properly then the next possible scenario due to which this is happening is filters in visual interaction okay it means if the edit interactions of that particular slicer is closed for all other five visuals then definitely that slicer will not affect to other five visuals okay so you have to make sure that in the format tab the edit interactions of that particular slicer is not closed for all other visuals of that particular page okay if it is closed then the slicer will not affect to other visuals so you have to check this edit interactions part as well all right then the next reason due to which this might be happening is data cardinality okay it means if there is many to many relationship it might be required additional consideration or adjustment so you have to ensure that the data model cardinality is appropriate for all type of relationship you want to establish all right so these are the five different most important reasons that might be due to which the slicer it means the second slicer are not affecting to the all other visuals of that particular page okay so i hope this video is helpful for you so if you like this video please don't forget to share subscribe and like our channel tab tak kali take care bye bye